hello and welcome to my youtube channel in this video i will show you how you can insert data by using wix valor code so let's start now here i have created a one field a button and a wix collection to insert data by code you have to uh, by code or any or uh, by data set you have to create a wix collection means a database table and uh, you have to create some field field column in it here i have created only one column there is a button save its id is this and here you can add on click first you have to select this button these option will appear on click function okay now first you have to import wix data library wix data So let's write our code here with data dot insert this will be a query so first of all you have to create a array variable let's say to insert is equal to here you have to write one by one if you have a four field five seven or ten or how many you have you have to write all the field name here here you have to write uh, database here you have to write wix collections field key name key id so location this is the location its key field key is location all cap uh, small letter location here you have to write this field name location hashtag location dot value if you have multiple values here you can write all the field one by one next you have to write query which data dot insert here you have to give a collection id which collection id so this collection id is project next you have to write this variable array variable to insert next we will write then results this section we will use to make display a message like your data is inserted successfully and in catch we will get the errors or exception occur during the insertion process Here we will display a message that our data is inserted successfully or failed to insert data.
let's its id is message first we will hide this collection collapse now here we will message dot text is equal to data is saved successfully show this message field expand same thing we will do here but here we will display the error so let's publish it or just click on preview when you create your collection you have to set its permission who can add data who can delete data like this data is saved successfully